So welcome to Legends of Runeterra. The closed beta has officially started and is in play for about five days. I have built, on the request of the masses, a Karma-focused deck. So Karma is a champion which creates a random spell in the hand, uh, levels up if you're enlightened, which is when you have 10 max mana. So that got me to looking up for ways to ramp. Most of the ways to ramp are in Freljord. So I've put in the mana ramp cards in Freljord, and then I've put in all of the enlightened cards across Freljord in Ionia. And then we have a minor Elnook theme, where with the three very basic four mana, four or five Elnooks, we also have a troop of Elnooks. With the troop of Elnooks, if I have Elnooks on the top of my deck, I summon them right into play. That's value. So we have ramp, we have Elnooks, and... We have pretty defensive, late game oriented deck. The Madman! Okay, keep the champions. Champions are OP. I'm on the attack this turn. I shall play the Weirding Stones, and then attack with them. I will choose not to attack. Stun an enemy, okay. I can either play Bull Elmuk or I can play Braum. Let's play Braum. Is it the mustache? Who knows? When Braum survives 10 total damage, he becomes upgraded Braum. You are safe with Braum. Braum recovers health each time, so each attack I'm gaining a little bit of value. It is easy, see? Easy. Let's get my karma input. Ionia speaks through me. All right. So the cool thing is being attacked from Brom. We should be friends. Just to take damage on Brom. Aha. Uh -huh. Now survive seven total damage out of ten. Deal four to an enemy unit if it has zero power, otherwise frostbite it. Kill an ally to draw two. Phantom Prankster, when another ally dies, deal one to the enemy nexus. They have 8 mana. I should really play my ramp. Ah, a wrestling partner. I'll just play a happy Elnook. Why are they attacking with a 0-3? I don't know. Act with conviction. Misplay! Stand behind Brom! They have no mana, so no tricks. <laughs> Upgraded Braum, when I survive damage, summon a mighty Poro. The mighty Poro is a 3 mana 3 3. Nice. After every winter, spring. <laughs> Ooh, deny. Very nice. Okay, now with a upgraded Braum, my defensive capabilities are insane. The people are my strength. When I'm summoned, grant me plus one plus one for each other ally. Okay, let's uh start summoning Poros. Good luck! 
So what I can do is pull in the 6-6 six, six if I expect them not to have any tricks. Why do I have to take a risk like that? Just to push in 3 damage of the turtle? That seems silly. Kill an L if you draw 2. Oh! Excellent play. Grant an ally barrier and lifesteal this round. Very nice. Kill a unit. Do I have a counter to that? Why, yes, I do. It's called a deny. <laughs> no, there shall be no killing of Brom. Reconsider. Wow. Let's see. This is nine mana. More turtles, I guess. Right now, I have the problem that my board is too full in order to summon more mighty Poros, but I guess that's a first world problem. Ah, they decided to attack. Okay. Well, that frees up my board space. Note that the order in which you attack in matters because my board space frees up after this happens. And I guess we'll block the 6-6 six, six, or the 3-7. Well. Grant all battling followers. Oh. Easy, see? I didn't like mm. as one. When you play a spell, cast it again on the same targets. Oh, Shatter! Oh my god! That's really insane with Shatter. Deal 4 to an enemy unit that has zero power, otherwise, Frostbite. Frostbite, by the way, sets something to zero power. By the way, slow spells can be played uh, not during combat tricks. It has to take one of your turn. Then yeah, casual uh, plus sixteen plus eight on a guy. What do we want to get plus sixteen plus eight? It's burst also, so uh, I could easily win right now. Here, let's uh, let's do a casual attack. Minus uh, four cost, thanks to having two cloud drinkers in play. First cards are played instantly and don't even take up like a pause. Step away, coward. He's like, <laughs> this fool. He didn't even provoke with the brom. Didn't, not, didn't even challenge, now that uh, Karma is gone. Black Spear from Ally died this round, deal 3 to an enemy unit. Yeah, okay. That's, that's pretty good. What about this? How about this 0 mana create a... Create 4 spells while I'm at it. Huh. That seems good. Draw Champion? Here, I get to find out what my hand size is while I'm at it. Okay, that's pretty good. Not bad. Okay, the hand size is 10. Granted damage ally plus 3 plus 3. That's, that's pretty good. Okay, yeah, let's do a little bit of that. Let's do a little bit more of that. Granted ally barrier and lifesteal. Seems like it could be good. Hey, look, it's a battle theory. Grants an ally plus 8 plus 4. That's pretty good. Kill anything free. Oh, it's the opponent's turn. Oh, I've roped! I roped! If I had more time, I could have done the potion on this thing. Well, that's uh. not bad.
You guys voted that I do Karma as my first hero, champion. I hope I have done Karma some amount of justice on day one of closed beta. I'm so tempted to keep Avros in Hearthguard. Seems so good. I'm just gonna keep it. Seems so good. Troop of Elnix. So first, you play the Avaros and Hearthguard, and then you play the Troop of Elnix, and the Troop of Elnix pulls out buff Elnix. The combo plan. Okay, right now I'm floating... Well, right now I have nothing to play, so I think I'm actually going to play Inside of Ages. Just to get a random spell. You can see the enemy faction before fighting. They're um, playing... I don't really recognize them by eye yet. So they're playing... Summon 3 Unleashed Spirit. Okay. So the, uh, deal 3 damage to face, pretty much. I'm gonna create a random spell. Shatter. Almost as useful as real Shatter. Oh, look at this combo! If three allies die, Callista levels up. And these guys have Ephemeral, so Callista will level up. Uh -oh. Am I up against a pro now? They even ordered it perfectly so that Callista attacked last. Oh no. I'm up against the pro! So there's a slow play and there's a fast play. Slow play? I think I can get away with just playing this right now. We fight for one failure. Buff the deck first, and then play Troop of Elnix. The fast play is to play Troop of Elnix right now. Oh, I'm on attack, so I don't have to worry. But the next turn, they'll be on attack. The Undying. Last Breath revive me at start of a round, and grant me plus one plus one for each time I've died. Spooky. But three mana two two and can't block. So it's just every turn that thing is dying uh, when it attacks and then becomes one bigger. Value over time. So they're on the attack, they can choose to attack first, or they can choose to play more cards. I think they want to choose to play more cards because currently the attack right now would just have me block the 5 3 with this 5 6. And then they would only get 4 damage through. So that means I'm gonna get a chance to play my Troop of Elements. Oh, they're going in. And then I have the choice to not block with my Weirding Stones. I'm gonna take one damage over possibly Stand facing a trick. Defend. Eh, well, I... Nah, let's block. And then the Undying, I don't have to block it. It just deals one damage to me, whatever. Alright, here we go. Troop of Elnux. Cool. I got an Elnook. When I'm summoned, create a copy in hand of an ally that died in this game. What's that noise? So I think I'm going to simply attack first. And then I will play another troop of Elnix. Because I want to try to free up some board space in the case that I get more Elnix. No board space is freed. I guess we'll just play a turtle.
This Callista isn't that good. It's just a 3 mana 5 3 if it's uh, bonding dies. Rush offerings. If 3 plus allies have died this round, summon Valmo. Okay, that's pretty good. 3 mana 6 6 fearsome. All done. No place for the kind anymore. Kill an ally, then revive it. Last of breath. Revive me at start of round, then grant me plus one plus one for each time I've died. Ah, so the revived version cannot come on because the board is full. This is a problem that I've seen playing spiders. <laughs> running out of board space. So the Unleashed Spirit was not able to join in the field because there's not enough space. So Callista is currently not uh, getting tanked for. This is our homeland! Our vengeance has burned long enough! Act now! They have to swap these two. I guess I just... Okay. Oh! Okay. The stones are too spooked from Vile Mall to block. We shall Too spooky for me. Many tribes under one banner. There was hope. What? Get in there. As soon as I get to 10 mana, I'm going to have some huge guys. Okay, let's see if I can summon some Elnix. Commander Ledger, cut the enemy Nexus health in half. Okay, round it down, round it up. Round it up. Ouch. I just don't have enough board space for this troop of Elnix. Okay, just wait until I get to 10 mana, then I can play this Lifesteal, which is an 8 8. I have 3 mana 8 8, 2 mana 8 8, 2 mana 7 7. And I've got some random spells, which are gonna create two of. I have 13 mana. Need to stabilize here. Oh no! Take an ally in hand, summon an exact copy of it, it's a feather. They summoned a Hecarim. Okay. I'm gonna play my lifesteal guy. So now if they attack, I'm going to generate lots of health by blocking. When Hecarim attacks, summons two attacking Spectral Rider. You've attacked eight plus Ephemeral allies. Ephemeral allies have plus two, plus zero. Now, spookily enough, they don't necessarily want to attack because I can get my lifesteal on them. Let's get my two spells. It's a burst, so it's uh, so fast that it doesn't even take an action. Oh, what's going on? Hecarim's Onslaught of Shadows. Shuffle to, shuffle to sp Okay, that's fine. I might have drawn a counter spell or something. A deny. Summon two exact copies of an ally there, Ephemeral, so I don't have room to do anything right now. 
don't think anything is important. I can just block anything. Yeah, it's Frostbite plus 8 six. Kinda spooky. We don't want to kill it. A little bit. Something slightly interesting is I do want my troop of Elnux to die. That I have enough board space to summon something. Every step brings me closer to deliverance. Stand and defend! I will learn from you. <laughs> I actually want to give them barrier here. I've got some big... This is our homeland! Find enlightenment. Okay. This attack is about to ruin them! My Defender's way. advantage! <laughs> they lose everything! I gain eight! My 2 mana 7-7, seven, seven. I should have played my 2 mana 8-8. Eight, eight. Oh well. Oh pal! I think I actually wanted to lose my wording stones there. This is going a lot better than when I built an aggressive deck. 